Oh man, this is probably the one of one of the hardest words I've had to give. But he showed it to me first because he always shows it to me first, and the videos are becoming more frequent. Um, because the time's getting closer and closer, and I'm he's brought me to a place now where I'm not concerned about what people think, and less and less I feel that you know, whatever fear, anxiety, or whatever that the, the devil tries to put in there, I'm getting more and more confident and stronger and stronger in my faith. And this is a hard saying, but God says the sons of disobedience, those who are willingly pledging their faith and allegiance over and over again to this vaccine 666 mark of the beast jab for corona, he says to those, <laughs> I have to say it. He says, I look at you like Esau. I feel the same way. Because you have heard my children crying out like a voice in the wilderness. And still, you choose the world. You choose the beast. You choose the system. You choose the image, the false church. The buildings, the forms of godliness. You choose everything but me. You choose the big name pastors. You choose the false teachers. It is the lust in your heart. It is the pride of life, the lust of the eyes, the lust of the flesh that you desire. You don't desire me. You who willingly trust the government, you who willingly Trust the pharmacy that is sorcery. Sorcery. It has been sorcery from the beginning. My sons and daughters don't rely on pills. They rely on me. But you don't want me. You don't truly believe in me, says the Lord. Otherwise, your faith would have made you well. Did you think that was figurative when I wrote through my servant that faith makes you well? Am I not God? This is what the Lord Jesus Christ is saying. It's a hard saying, but choose this day whom you will serve. I shall show mercy upon whom I will show, show mercy if you repent of this, says the Lord. There is hope. Repent. 